Got a couple tins that I picked up at Walmart yesterday. Got a Divergent Powers tin. I haven't seen that in a while. That has a couple Evolving Skies I think it should have. Pretty nice pack selection there. I got the Typhlosion, Pursuian Typhlosion promo. So we got that. And we got this new, this is why I uh, went there. This is what I was specifically looking for. Uh, I got the Galarian Zapdos. And the Galarian Articuno, they were out of the Moltres. But this will be my first one of these tins that I'm opening up. Take a closer look at that promo. We get five Crown Zenith packs. But I haven't looked at that promo before, so I want to check that out. There's that code. I do think, I mean, this has the uh, yellow border. I feel like this one would have looked maybe better with the silver, but this actually looks pretty good. Condition as with, I mean, all of the, uh, like, trainer gallery, Galarian gallery sort of cards seem to have this same sort of not perfectly cut edge, but... The artwork on that is really cool. Got Dodrio there being chased away by Galarian Zapdos. I like that art. Galarian Zapdos has some good arts. So let's get into this. Let's start with the Crown Zenith. No, because that means I'm going to end on Evolving Skies, which never gives last pack magic. So we'll start with Astral Radiance. Magnemite, Ralts, Sween Sneasel, Mistrevis, Barboach. Hey, starting off with a hit, Radiant Greninja. And Mightyena. This Radiant Greninja looks pretty pretty good. And Greninja's a cool Pokemon. Condition wise that looks good as well. Starting off with hit. So we'll go back and forth. We got Crown Zenith. I haven't been opening too much Crown Zenith. I've been trying to uh, put together a couple binders. My Hidden Fates binder, my Lost Origin binder. Galarian Meowth and Galarian Berserker. Oh, we got the Evolution there. And also, I... I'm not having the best of luck with Crown Zenith. I don't know, just... Doesn't excite me. You know, I don't know. This uh, Astral Radiance pack feels a little different than that first one. We got Togepi, Magmite, Ralts, Sunian Sneasel, Mistrevis. Pretty nice looking Eevee there. And a Registeel. Back to Crown Zenith. Still want the, uh, the Suicune V Alt Art from Crown Zenith, I think. That would be a cool pull. Corefish, Ponard, Seal, Rockruff, Aron, Cheruby, and Blossom. I did not have the reverse hollow seal from uh, Lost Origin. That surprised me. I had almost all the other reverse hollows. Baltoy, Snow Runt, Nosepass, Milsery, Cup Chew, Chinchino, and Infernape. Hollow. Zenith. 
So Walmart was pretty well stocked. They had uh, Crown Zenith ETBs. They had some collector's chests, the fall one. They had um, Salen Deet and Calarium Berserker. That's our second Calarium Berserker. They had um, a couple Charizard UPCs. They had uh, some V Heroes tins. They had a pretty good assortment. They had a uh, Silver Tempest uh, bundles, the six pack bundles. C Dot and Shiftry. All right, I guess we're only gonna get that Radiant Greninja. I am waiting for uh, some reprints to come. I've been trying to save some of the funds for. Uh, some reprints. Ah, uh, Lunatone. Galarian Gallery card. Nope, oh, we got an auto card there. Lunatone looks in decent condition. That's, I think that's the first one I pulled. Kind of a cool art. Also get this dropped autograph uh, beyond there. Evolving skies. And I opened uh, two evolving skies Lee trainer boxes, and I got nothing. I got a leafy on V regular, and uh, maybe a Garbodor V regular. I never expect anything from evolving skies. Crown Zenith to finish it off. Can we get last pack magic? Perline, I love this. The reverse hollow fire energy. I do like fire energies. And Zorora. Ooh, okay. Well, that fire energy is kind of cool. Okay. It's a cool gloom art. Well, not much. Not much in that. Here's some uh, codes. What do I got for codes here? Guys, what else? What else? That uh, Lost Origin Elite Trainer Box, Lost Origin Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box. Well, that's that. Good luck on your openings. See you in the next one.